and welcome back to the world of Don't Starve, Reign of Giants. And uh, it's been a while since I've played, and in fact I have not played since I died on uh, what was his face, Wolfgang. And yeah, so I figured what the hell, I have some time, and I really want to get farther into the game, so let's get started. Uh, let's see, play new game. Uh, let's change characters. We've already done Wilson, we've done Willow, we've done Wolfgang, died on him last time. We've done the bereaved Abigail, Wendy, Wendy, that's her name, Wendy. We've not done WX78, or Wickerbottom, or uh, Woody, Woody Lumberjacks. That's a nice tree, A eh? Has a lovely axe, has a terrible secret. Uh, knows many things, self-publishes books, can't sleep, hates spoilage. That seems like it would be annoying. Uh, not a picky eater, charged by lightning, damaged by water, can upgrade with gears. That could be interesting. Because with all those robot, do robot spring monster things around, there are plenty of gears to be had. But the whole damaged by water thing would be a bit annoying, so and can't sleep and hate spoilage is a real negative for her so yeah hmm. I think I'm gonna go with uh, Woody <laughs> just because I haven't played him yet and has a lovely axe probably means he comes with an axe so let us go with Woody with the standard world generation let's get going haha <laughs> Generating world, inserting game theory, framing trees, ridiculating, and beginning. Aha. Hello? Blank screen! Uh. Is it going? Is it actually loading? Huh? Here we go! Say, pal, you don't look so good. Haha. Uh, we've already seen that before. If you've watched any of my previous Let's Plays of this, uh, Lucy the Axe, equip. Yep, he comes with an axe! I missed you so much. Aw. So, chop, chop, chop. Oh, wow. That is an awesome axe. Just chop, chop, chop really, really fast. So much better than the flint axes you can just make. And apparently it has no durability, because it's not, uh, breaking at all. Which is very nice! So, this is Don't Starve, again, Reign of Giants. Uh, I've already done a playthrough, like I said, with Wolfgang of Reign of Giants. I got pretty far in it last time. Got all the way to Winter Time. Nearly made it all the way through Winter Time before I died. Horribly to the deer clops, which was a pain in the butt to actually have happen. But, uh, yeah. It happened, and there's not really much I can do about that. <laughs> uh, when the deer clops comes, and you are all by yourself, I could really use a shovel. But in order to get that, I need a, uh, science machine to do that. So, I'm gonna have to wait till I find some gold. Grab up all these carrots. Get some more wood. There we go. Because... Uh, look at these trees. <laughs> uh, careful, you're getting yourself worked up. I wonder what that means. <laughs> Is he actually just talking to his axe? Probably, maybe, I don't know. Uh, let's see, I need a pickaxe. Which means I needed one more flint. Which is nice, since I do not have to worry about making an axe. I can just go ahead and make a pickaxe and get these rocks. Now, the only problem is, uh, where I have started, there is apparently not a lot of grass. Uh, I'm not seeing a lot of grass here, so I'm going to have to go pretty far out, I'm guessing. see. Uh, I started here. 
Maybe I should do what I did last time and just do a big circle around the starting area. Because that's what I always end up doing is I go off in one direction and I end up missing something that was right next to me the entire time. <laughs> because that always happens. It always friggin' happens. I end up needing gold and there's gold right next to me right at the starting area and I miss it because I'm an idiot and I didn't go 20 feet. Yep, here we go. Mine this stuff right here. Should be some gold in there, maybe. Huh? Ah, one gold nugget. Very nice. Now, I do not want to set up camp right here because there's not really a uh, ready supply of food. No rabbit holes or anything. So, I'm going to have to go out and look for some plains areas in order to find some rabbit holes because I don't see any on here. Maybe up here? Or is that all water? Eh, looks like water. Uh, I also don't have a lot of food. Let's see. Okay, let's start circling back down. Make sure we don't miss anything. Or wait, is this uh, just a small patch? There's some berries. Well, it may as well try and get this area mapped out so I won't be able to won't have to come back up here and I should have enough to build a quick fire should I need it and I can go ahead and grab this stone which is very nice uh, still need to figure out what this night or is for I've played through this game a few different times and I still have no idea what night is for I mean, it's probably something in the uh, crafting menu, and I just have not found it. But, uh, yeah. But I do have enough gold to make a science machine, I think. Yeah, there we go. So once I find a good spot, I'll be able to set up a... Oh, damn it. I'll be able to set up a science machine straight away, and I will be able to get started. But I want to make sure I buy some rabbit holes or or maybe some fishing holes, some frog pond things. Because there is fishing in this game, I just never did it. Mainly because you need uh, spider silk to do that, and I have tried to avoid the spiders. Uh, so where am I going? Okay, let's head south here. Ooh, seeds. Very nice. Not something else. I need to find some... Ooh, some mushrooms. Some, uh beefalo so I can get some poop and I can set up Ooh, what's this aha a spear very nice and a gnome and a box thing which I cannot hold because my inventory is filled like a moron so I'm just gonna eat those uh, ah. let's make sure I don't leave anything behind Okay, got enough to build a fire, and I'm lighting this area up right here, right now, real quick. That way I can go ahead and mine up all this stone while I'm waiting for the night to pass, and maybe cut down some trees. Ah, uh, so far not too bad. I've got some food, not a lot, three carrots, four berries. Uh, once I can get a shovel and get a place set up, I'll uh, build my science machine. And uh, I'm already filled with rocks. I already have a lot of rocks. Huh. Uh, can I make a hat? Hat would be nice. Hat? Oh, don't have enough grass. Uh, because apparently a hat can actually help keep you dry which is something I did not realize. Oh, I need more grass. Damn it. Let's go ahead and, and uh, mine this up. Ah, let's see. Oop, can't pick that up. Oh, crap. No, no, I did not want to go down there. No, no. No, I did not want to go down the cave. I wanted to pick stuff up. And it's dark down here. Uh, oh, no. No, this is not good. This is not good at all. 
I need to get back up there. Uh, it's dark, isn't it? It's going to be dark. Oh crap! It's dark. Damn it! Uh, is our fire still going? Please still be going. Damn it! <laughs> I did not want to go down in the hole. No, I do not want to go down the hole. Oh crap! Uh, our fire went out. Fire went out. Damn it! Oh, oh crap! Uh, grab some logs. There we go. There. Ugh! I really do need to get. Ah, there we go. Pick up the flint. Pick up the flint. Can't pick up the rocks. I've got 40 rocks. Fairly nice. Can I cook some of these berries or carrots? There we go. I'll go ahead and munch on these. There we go. Now I can pick up the rocks. Ah, here we go. One more rock. And it should be daytime right about. Pick up these seeds and munch on them. Aha. If I can get some uh, more grass, I'll be able to make a straw hat. Hopefully it'll help me with this rain. Because that is one of the main problems. Ugh. Let's see. Where do I want to go? I explored this area, so let's keep heading south, I guess. Now, uh, let's head south. Heading south. Hopefully we can find some grass. Uh, here we go. Grab some more rocks. And... Ooh! Some more gold. Friggin' mole there. Ah, uh, come on. Grab the gold. Uh, stupid mole. Go away. Here we go. Grass. And some more twigs. Desperately need more grass. Twigs, not so much. But I do need some more gold. Come on, gold. Uh, rain is not going up. My uh, moisture level isn't going up all that badly. So I should be okay. Ooh, grass, grass, grass. Come on. I need 12 grass in order to make a hat. Uh, let's see. I think this is a dead end down here. Just want to come down here and get it mapped out. Yep, it's a dead end. Which means... There we go. It's mapped out so I don't have to worry about coming back down here. <laughs> uh, I really do need to find... Ooh, gold. Gold, free gold. And a grave. Uh, there we go. Some more grass. Some more rocks. Graveyard. Uh, where are all the, uh, plains areas? Because that's what I really need right now, some plains areas. That way I can get some poop, I can make some farms, maybe get some rabbit uh, traps going. And it looks like this is a dead end up here. Just want to get it mapped out. And, yep, it's a dead end. But some free rocks. So not a complete waste of time. Free rocks. And some flint. I've nearly got a stack of flint. Yeah, that's fairly nice. I remember one time I actually did not have any flint at all. Had to run around for days looking for flint. But now, plenty of flint. And some berries. Uh, there we go. Now, I might need to go ahead and grab some more wood. And it looks like there's something down there. A touchstone! Activate the touchstone. Ah, safety net engaged. Now if we die, I'll be able to come right back. Right there. Which might be a good idea to leave my camp around here. Or at the very least, have a secondary camp nearby. Come on, there's got to be something here. Anything? No? Nothing? Okay, there was a road up here. Let's follow the road and see if we can actually make it anywhere. 